All right. Good morning, girls. Good morning. I'm going to call you girls. I think that's nice and appealing, isn't it? So, who haven't met me before? I'm Zara. Zara Dalrimpel. I have a shop in East Kinstead. I've had the shop now for two, uh, ten and a half years. I love it. Absolutely mad about flowers. And um, we met last year once here, and I was showing you alternative things to the Christmas wreath. So this year I'm going to go the vice versa. We had the traditional table arrangement last year. Um, we had alternative thing for the door. So this year I'm going to go vice versa. I'm going to show you kind of traditional table arrangement, but not. And I'm going to show you normal traditional Christmas wreath. And then something else from off my sleeve. So the table arrangement. All of you asking me most of the time when you come to the shop how long the flowers last. And of course, with all the secrets and everything that we have in the shops and there's professionals, we use the oasis and the different things. But of course, you understand the flowers would last much longer if they are arranged in water. I'm going to show you how to arrange the flower arrangement in water with the candle. So what you have, you take the candle, well, how do we fix that? Because we're going to raise that now and use it like in a hand tie. There's my tape, which I prepared earlier. Did you use too much blue Peter? I heard about blue Peter. I'm pretty sure we had the similar programs in Soviet Union. So here you go. We raise the candle, so we can use that as a base now. And then, nowadays, you have beautiful, beautiful flowers. I mean, I have always excuse to use any flowers or to buy any flowers, which I absolutely, totally, and utterly love. I love her ginger. However, autumnal they look. They're still on the table arrangement because they've got so many different shades to them. You can have it on a table arrangement and it wouldn't look out of the place. Some of you who met me before, do you remember my beautiful cordial line tips? So you've got the stem of the cordial lines and then you've got six or seven leaves on each stem. I do torture them though. <laughs> I do staple them because I like the texture. So if you leave them straight, they're going to cover the other flowers and that's not what we want to do. You have to remember one other thing. Whenever you look outside and you see the greenery, bushes, trees and everything else, most of the flowers, most of the trees have a greenery. The flowers there just to complement. It's the same thing like with us. We get dressed, but we've got just a little touch of jewelry. We're not putting a lot and lots of jewelry on ourselves because then it looks out of the everything, isn't it? So let's get to that one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the leaves first. The reason I'm putting the leaves first, so I've got that edging. I'm not putting the pine first because the first thing in the forest which burns is the pine. Please, please, please never ever come out of the room and leave that arrangement lit up. We don't want any accidents or incidents. So we're going to go hydrangea one side. To balance that, we're going to have a big ball on this side. Then we're going to Lucasperum. I love tropical flowers. They just they just incredible. We're going to have a Lucas Perum from the other side. Now we're going to edge that again with the greenery. You see all these leaves because they've got that pink edge to them. And because you've got a little bit of touch of pink and purple here, so it's all complements, it's all works together. Then we go. These roses, they're called piano roses. They are spray roses. You can see they have few heads and you 
with now industry, you see what they're trying to do? They look like uh, pianists. So we can't do your wedding in the middle of the December and use that. They come in a different colors as well, which would make you like imitation of the pianists. And they look incredibly beautiful. The reason I love them, because it's just the texture. They just have so many layers, so many petals on them. And what we do, we go round and round and round like Earth around the world, around the sun. Look how beautiful it is. If, unfortunately, with all the engineering, that particular type of the flowers, none of the roses now do have a scent. Any flowers which do have a scent, they don't last as long as the ones which we normally buy now for the industry. So you have to lose somewhere. But because I've worked for quite a some time with the flowers, I know the flowers which still do have, especially roses, do still have a scent. And I have, when we have big wedding fairs or big shows, if I make the stand and I take the flowers with me, I always take scented flowers because you cannot pass. You can't walk in and it's the scent which attracts you. Didn't I, Jeannie? Yes, that's right. Yes. And I'm always saying, I mean, just a pretty face. <laughs> so look, girls, and then we're putting the pine just at the edge. So it's quite far from the candle. And what I'm doing, I'm edging everything with the greenery just to finish it off. I usually call it to put the skirt on the girl. So it's all finished nicely and beautifully. And then we want to have a little bit of flour. So we'll put a little bit of eucalyptus. And we tape it. So that's what we got. I'll tell you what's the easiest thing to do with any flowers when you're trying to arrange the flowers, if you group them. If you, you know, because when I started, of course, my hands wouldn't hold the flowers as well, and I struggled when you put one flower, the other one moves to the other side. You have to, you know, you have to show the flowers who is the boss. <laughs> you hold them, and the greenery. Girls, we always, always forget about the greenery. But remember, any time when we try to arrange the flowers indoors, all we do, bringing that outside, nature, inside. And what the nature has? It always has the lots and lots of leaves. The flowers, they're just to complement. So when you have leaves, because the leaves do support the flowers, that's why it's easier to arrange the flowers. So, ta-da! Very nice. Oh,